Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. Thank you for joining me today. I just got a delivery from Coach and I'm so excited because I love this bag. I know what this bag is, I have it. I've shown it to you. It is this bag, which is the Coach Field Tote with the horse and carriage print. And this, this is the size 11 and 3 quarters by 11 and 3 quarters and it which is actually 30 centimeters they have a larger one and i'm a large girl tote i love large totes but i i've never been to the store and i've never seen this in a store so when i ordered it i felt the large one was too big for me based on my calls to several different stores who told me that i would be able to fit inside it so i bought the small one and i absolutely love it but then I noticed the people who watched my video told me they are buying the large one. And I felt I should see this one and make a dis determination for myself. I didn't go to the store because the store is a three hour trip for me. And if there's traffic, it goes into four hours. And with, the, with this being the, the Christmas season and the holiday season in general, uh, my husband was not able to take off work to drive me because I can't drive that far. So I had to order it, and I'm going to either keep it, keep both of them, or return this one. I'm not sure. It depends on how big it is for me. I would like to keep both. I hope I could swing it, being that Christmas is the season for giving, and I have to give other people besides myself. We have 18 grandchildren. So I'm, I'd like to try and keep it if possible. So let's just open it and see. And I really hope this is packed as well as the one that I received from Brandon. And he is on Instagram. He is Brand Brand 1984. And he is an awesome, awesome sales associate. And I got it in the most perfect condition in the most beautiful packaging. And I will put the link to that video underneath this just the description of this video <clears throat> and actually I have two other videos on on this particular new collection one is uh, <clears throat> what's in my bag and the other one is an unboxing of this one and this will be the third and, and I'm, so actually this is done by request as well so let's see this big this pack this package by the way weighs seven pounds from UPS. And I can't flip. Okay, there it is. Ah, it's in a box. Much to my surprise, I must say, my happy surprise. Very nice, very nice. Get this out of the way will have something to play with while I'm talking to you. So already I see this has to have been folded. I can't see this handles being straight. As when I got it from Brandon, this is how it came. It's in a dust bag. Not, I, this is not part of the 1941 collection. And it's a little bit of a knot, <laughs> of course. So sorry, this is where editing would come in. <laughs> and there you go. And it is folded down. The handles. And There's no, no, no padding in this, no paper. There's just 
for the sides and that's it. This comes from the website, the coach website. This does not come from a store. Do you think this is too big for, is there even handles in here? Wait. There's, oh, no, I can't, oh my God. Do you remember I had a bag that didn't come with the strap? It was the, um, it was the tabby, the shoulder bag tabby. It didn't have a, a shoulder strap. So far I don't see it. It does come with the pouch, and this is a larger pouch than the one I have in this and the smaller one, his way bigger pouch. That's the difference in the pouch. Wow, big difference. So let's see if I have the, the handle with this. It's not gonna be good. Oh my goodness. Oh, here it is. Okay, here's the handle. This is I should say the strap. This is so smooth and soft. Okay, let's compare the sizes. This is a huge difference, totally huge. The depth. The height. Can you see the difference from here? I would say See how big the difference is? About an inch and three quarters difference in height, I, I think. This one with, with the print only, without other embellishments such as uh, the print like the, the unicorn or, or whichever prints, a rainbow. This is this one is only available online. It feels very nice. Very nice. Let's take that back. Is attached it's attached to the side. This is an, an idea of the size inside. I'll just take this strap off and show you better. That's big. This is really big. This is a six inch handle drop. What do you think? This is really nice for a, <coughs> excuse me, for a pouch, really nice. This one is a lot smaller. I haven't used this yet. Still has.
has the price tag on, which is three fifty. This one is three ninety five. This is definitely a, a GM size. This is too big for me. This I thought was perfect, especially if I wear it as a crossbody. See, if this had, if this had more of a handle drop and I could wear it on my shoulder, I wouldn't even think twice. But because I can't wear this on my shoulder, I'm wondering how I'm going to carry it. I'm going to carry it as a crossbody or on my sh on my shoulder with a strap, like that. I'm, I wouldn't carry it by hand. I don't carry things by hand. It's pushed in. I guess stuffing would help will help this somewhat I hope. And also the handles are not well these hands handles stay up. And this has been in my closet for I think two weeks already. Or a good ten days. These handles are not staying up, but I can train them. I can put them on a doorknob. And that should work. What do you think everybody? Do I need both of these? Do, will this one work for me? I'd as far as taking this on travel, for travel, yeah, I don't think I would want to take it on for traveling right now because it's so new I wouldn't want anything to happen to it. I have two really large, um, <coughs> excuse me, two really large market totes, the, the large market totes, and they are, I, they're about equal in size, but it's a different shape. And the handles go on your shoulder and you wear it on your shoulder. This is six inches, so even though it fits on my shoulder, I, I don't think this would work for that. The bottom has pebble leather and feet. A little more pliable than this one. Even, this is stuffed now, but even when it's not stuffed, this is how it is. It has, seems to have structure, a little more structure. And the bag seems to have more structure. The, the uh, stuffing inside, which is, that's how I store it, is, isn't changing it. This is exactly how it was. And the, this is, this is actually a magnet here, this closure. And this inside is a, it looks like it's an ox blood and it's a microfiber. And you could definitely fit a lot in here. This is the other bag in it, and still room to spare. But it does look a little better with the bag in it, giving it a little form, a little more form. Let's see how much it weighs. This one, I think, is almost two pounds. If I remember correctly, it was like one pound nine ounces, something like that.
think they said it was one pound, 10 ounces. So it's really, this, this must be lighter if it's almost the same weight. It's just an ounce different and that's so much smaller. This, must, this does seem like it's less constructed and more fluid. So everybody, what do you think? Do you like it? Do you like it on me? Should I just stick with this one? Which I love? Or do I, do I need both of these? Or is this too big on me? Or is this right for you? But the, which one is right for you, do you think? That would be, I would rather know what, if, if it's right for you than if it's right for me. I'd really be interested in that. They both have black pebble leather and like a tannish stitching. They both have a black coach hang tag. The color of this is called pewter and black. And let me tell you the exact specifics of this bag. It is 40 centimeters, which is 15 and three quarter inches in the length. It is 14 inches in height and a whopping eight inches in the depth. Thank you so much for watching everybody. I hope you have a wonderful day and I hope to read your comments. I love you guys. Take care and happy shopping. See you soon. Love you guys. Bye. Hi, I just wanted to come back and do a few mod shots and show you a couple of features which I didn't mention in the first part of this video. One of the features is that there's a D-ring in here and I don't even think I was aware of it before. And the D-ring is over here underneath where this, uh, where this is, is a, a tiny D ring, and that is for the, the pouch to hook up to, so you could use it as a secure pocket in here, uh, so no one could take it out of your bag without you knowing about it. Also, the hardware is pewter. I, I know I mentioned it before, but the color of this is called uh, black brown. If you like charms, and I just got a charm, which I'm using this for my for my Oxblood Road, but this is part of this charm is part of this collection, and this is the unicorn. Isn't that cute? So you could use it on here, but I let me show it to you. It's really cute. It's leather. I like leather charms. This has Oxblood around it, and. The back is all ox blood, but the handles are continuous, so you could put it on one side or the other without taking it off, without undoing it. I fixed the strap so I could show you how it looks when I have it on. This is it as a crossbody. It's empty now, so it is collapsing on me. I'm sure that if there was something in it, it wouldn't. I'm going to hold it down. How about you care to carry it? You could also wear it as a shoulder bag. This is the large one compared to this one. This is the shoulder bag. Oh, look, I'll do it on one on your shoulder. And this is how it will look as a crossbody. But this is short right now. I adjusted it to be short. 
So it, if it was a crossbody, I could adjust it to be longer because this is a 23 and a half inch drop. This does not feel like a seat belt. I know some people, I've read comments about uh, people thinking this feels like a seat belt. This is very lightweight and very, very soft. Very soft and smooth. Very, very comfortable. This is a little difficult for me to adjust, but my husband showed me how. You have to push it through this way and you have to grab it and pull it and then pull, yank it from this side and you could adjust it. Now look at how beautifully it's finished. What a beautiful bag. Whether I keep this one or not, I'm definitely keeping this one. And this charm also is from the collection, the, um, the horse and carriage collection. And this also is leather. It's called uh, Pink Arrow or Bow and Arrow Pink, something like that. And I love it. I, th I think it do does a lot for this plain background, which I consider this to be a monogram. So everybody, oh, just let me show you one other thing. The Samorga, the Samorga organizer, which I bought for my Speedy 30. I'm able to use it in here, and I showed you that before, but I'm also able to use it in here, but it doesn't take up the entire space. And I'll show you how that looks. You still have, you could have, you could have this in the middle and space on each side, or you could put it to one side, and you would have this much well, I'd say about a few inches. It's hard to tell like this, but a few inches extra space that wouldn't be in the organizer. But just keep in mind that this is heavy when you have things in it. I, we weighed it at uh, one pound, 10 ounces. Let's see what it is with the organizer, the strap on and the pouch inside. Three pounds, one and a half ounces. And before it was almost two pounds. So yeah, it's it's at least a pound more. So keep that in mind, if that matters to you. So now I really will say goodbye, everybody. And I just wanted to make sure that I told you all the information that I knew about it so you can make an informed decision. I love you guys, and I will see you in the next video. I hope you have, if I don't see you before the holidays, I hope your holiday, whatever you're celebrating, is wonderful and the year ahead is wonderful for you and your loved ones. Take care, everybody. I love you guys. See you next time. Bye.